The Savannah Effect. Why do we love water, greenery, and open spaces? Do you know why? Because I love the ocean. I mean, <laughs> that's one reason. She loves the ocean. But the Savannah Effect is the effect where human beings love to see open space, greenery, water, trees, flowers. Why do we do that? What's going on in our Stone Age brain? It's not just because it looks pretty and because the ocean is calming. It's The real question is why is it calming? Well, it turns out that when we were cavemen in our Stone Age times, an open space meant that tribes could see opposing tribes coming over the hill. So there was plenty of time for them to see an opposing tribe that might come and kill and rape and pillage. If there was greenery and shrubs and plants, then it signified being able to eat food. It signified a place where they could grow food. It signified fertile ground. And if there was water, well, same thing. It meant that you'd be able to drink water. It, it meant life. Why do portraits in art galleries, why are they so popular? Why do humans love to just look at portraits of landscapes? Why do people love to look at landscapes? Because it appeals to our Stone Age brain. It appeals to our cavemen brain of, oh, we can see the opposing tribes and oh, there's likely to be able, there's likely to be food and water there. Think about it, why is Central Park in New York City so popular? Because it's in the middle of the sprawling metropolis. People like to go there and they see water, they see lakes, they see trees, they see greenery. It's like, ah, oh, ah, oh, it's wonderful. They see open spaces. It's not just because, oh, we like the color green or we like the sound of water. It's because it's appealing to our reptilian brain, our Stone Age brain for survival. There's a book called Riveted by Jim Davies. It's a wonderful book, it's got an orange cover on it. He goes into more details as to why we like landscapes and talks a little bit more about the Savannah effect. So if you wanna read more about this, definitely check out that book. But as I'm standing here at Laguna Beach, California, looking at water, albeit not drinking water, and open space, and I can see people ahead of me, I can still see people behind me. This is appealing to my Stone Age brain, making me feel safe, making me feel happy. So whenever you're thinking about living somewhere, if you want to increase your levels of happiness, try to make sure that you see open space, water and greenery. Studies have shown that your happiness levels increase because of it. Go ahead and leave a comment down below right now. Tell me what you think about this. Make sure you follow me on Snapchat for more behind the scenes of my daily life. And uh, if you want to get my uh, secret formula for uh, beating procrastination, just go to jameswanick.com and I'll send you my free book on how to beat procrastination. All right, so from Laguna Beach, California, catch you on the next one. Hey, I'm James Swanick. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you want to watch my next video, then click here. If you want to subscribe to this channel to get new videos, click here. And if you want to follow me on social media, like my Snapchat right here, you can see my Snap. Click on the links down there. Go on, do it now. I'll wait for you. Snapchat, Snapchat me, Snapchat.